Hi, I'm Steve Turnage, uh, author of Desktop Mastering for Hal Leonard. Tracking, mixing, mastering, and distribution. This can be likened to making a pie. Tracking is gathering your ingredients together and getting the freshest things ready to go. Mixing is putting them together and into the baking dish, but you wouldn't want to eat that unbaked pie. Mastering is baking the pie and cooking it just right so that it uses everything that it has at its disposal to be as fragrant and delicious as possible. And then distribution is putting that hot apple pie on the windowsill and having people come up and, and, uh, and, and wanting a piece. What you send to a mastering engineer has to be at the end of the mix stage where it doesn't sound mastered already. If you take lead to an alchemist to transmute into gold, bring pure lead, not fake gold. So if it's all compressed and sounds like it's ready to go, it's probably not in a pre-mastered state. Well, unmastered tracks, when I listen to them, I have no problem turning them off. It's like, oh, okay. Mastered tracks, however, when you're listening to them, you don't want to turn them off. And a properly sequenced album that goes from song to song, you say, oh, I'll just listen to one more song, you reach for the stop button, and the next song comes on, and it's difficult to turn it off. That's really the difference between a mastered and unmastered track. 